Are you ready to see your new home? Let's show it to them! You missed him, didn't you? Thank everybody for being here and everything that you do. After spending a few months with this family, uh, I had noticed some things began to change with Colin. But then three days after we brought the family home, I got a call from Brother David. Colin was in the hospital. Looking at the blood count and cells under the microscope, I was 99% sure that this was leukemia. I'd see other kids on TV, you know, these kids got cancer, and now I'm with, like, I'm another kid in this group of statistics, you know, that either did good or did bad. I'm a kid that had cancer. We're doing um, chemotherapy, it's called pegasparaginase. All the stuff that they've done to him, I mean, he's handled it like a champ. You did fabulous! You are awesome. I think Kenny would want Colin to know that as he starts with having to deal with the leukemia, that right from the beginning, understand that God has a plan. Colin had so many visitors bringing him cards and gifts. What have you got in your hand? Oh my pizza God. for everybody! Wait, hey, you can't bring pizza in here. What are you talking about? It's okay. He has cheese on it. Everything that the family had went through, you know, how could they go through another tragedy like this? I couldn't imagine what was going through Karen's mind. And it's just amazing to think what Karen had ahead of her, and she took it in stride. She listened. She knew what she had to do, and when she left, I had utmost confidence that she would handle it. We've just begun to experience what we're going to experience with Colin, but I'd like for things to get back, you know, as close to normal as possible.